Mojave National Preserve. Yes, it's in the Mojave Desert, it's in Southern California, and it's fabulous, but it's remote. Take water. And not only take it, drink it. Travel across America with me. Let's go to Hole in the Wall and catch one of the most famous trails in all of California and for sure in the Mojave National Preserve. It's called the Rings Loop Trail. It's a half mile round trip. The trailhead begins at the picnic area, which is two tenths of a mile northwest of the Hole in the Wall Information Center. Make note that the Hole in the Wall Information Center is only open seasonally and has short hours. And you'll also want to note that sometimes the trails are closed when it's way too hot to be out there in the desert. So always check the website to make sure that there is access to this great Hole in the Wall Trail. According to an 1800s legend, Indians eluded ranchers as they descended down Banshee Canyon and disappeared from view. Now you can follow their footsteps with the help of metal rings mounted in the rock. Well, that was helpful. We have done this trail several times. Times, and I wanted to share it with you. The Mojave is a hot desert. Days with temperatures in excess of 100 degrees typically begin in May and can last into October. Within the Mojave National Preserve, temperatures reach 120 degrees. Winters, however, can bring freezing temperatures. If you want to know what the temperature is, there is, I think, it's probably the world's largest thermometer just to the east in Baker on I-15. Rainfall is a rare event in the preserve. The hole in the wall area is is at an elevation of 4,300 feet. And this is a popular destination that features unusual volcanic rock formations and activities, including camping, picnicking, and the nearby visitor center. There are two trails there leaving from the area. One is this one, the Hole in the Wall Rings Trail, which travels west approximately one quarter mile through the volcanic rock using metal rings to descend. And the other, the Hole in the Wall to Mid Hills, it is a seven mile trail which starts on Wild Rose Canyon Road near Hole in the Wall and winds through the terrain to Mid Hills Campground elevation of 1100 feet. Although there are a few established hiking trails, abandoned dirt roads, washes, and ridge lines offer an abundance of cross country hiking opportunities. But know that you will be on your own, even if on a designated trail. Please be sure you know where you are and take plenty of water. You can get very disoriented out there, even in your car. One time we were traveling through and these guys went speeding by, passing us on the left, and they had their window rolled down and they were hanging out with the sign asking if they were heading south. And yes, they were. They had gotten disoriented. Because you can't always depend on cell service when you're out in the desert. Sometimes you just need a compass and some old school tools to know where you are. Please subscribe so you can travel across America with me. This was the Rings Trail at Hole in the Wall. More Mojave stops coming soon and you'll want to watch my short on Zyzex. Zyzex? What's that? Well, it's XXY. No, it's ZZYZX. Zizek. That always confuses me. You'll see the exit and you'll want to take it. Watch the short to see why. Flip-flops in the sand. It's an unclassic road trip. And as I said, more Mojave stops coming soon. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment. Have you hiked in the desert? Where's your favorite place to hike in the desert?